Welcome back, dear viewers. You're still watching Nile Cruise or Nile TV, dear viewers. And now we have with us a very special artist. And today we have with us, um, of course, the amazing uh, pan flute player, which is Amr Samir. Amr Samir was born on 1969. He graduated from the conservatoire. And of course, in 1991, he completed his uh, studies in the United States and in, in um, the United Kingdom. And also, he uh, participated in a number of international festivals. Amr Samir, of course, is one of the very special pan flutes uh, players here in Egypt and today we have him with us and it's a pleasure to have him with us to more know more about him know more about his activities and know what he does here in Egypt I know he sings in the Opera House but we are here to know more about him Mohammed? Yes, um, hello uh, Amr, uh, nice to have you so in the summer of 69 I don't know if, uh, if you were born in the, in, the, in the summer indeed but of course um, I just want to say in the summer of 69 Amr, welcome home Thank you very much. I, I'm very glad to, to be with you and you. record in your uh, program, Nile Cruise. Program. Uh, Amr, uh, could you tell me more about, of course, I see you, um, you have with you a very different instrument. I know this instrument is, is, is the pan flute. I need you to tell me more about the pan flute and uh, I need to tell the viewers that you are now stable in Egypt and you're st you live in Egypt and you're not in the United States and you're not in England anymore you're back uh, in your hometown and in your homeland yeah that's true um, I'm um, before I was a member of the Cairo Symphony Orchestra but I was playing French horn it's a completely uh, different instrument and also uh, now I started to uh, from six years or seven years, I started to study the pen flute. Uh, I like this instrument. It's um, something like m makes you dream with this, uh, with with its sound. Mm. The pen flute made uh, from, as as I said, pen or bamboo, or the bamboo wood. Um, so. Okay, can you tell me more about the pan flute uh, or play uh, a piece of um, music on your pan flute? Sure. Okay. sure. Do you want me to hold you the mic when you're playing? No, it's okay. Okay. Thank you. 
Wonderful, uh, of course. Um, well this done. was the song Halwaya Baladi. Okay. Um, uh, who taught you uh, to play on the pan flute? Uh, I made a course in the um, Southwest Texas University in uh, in America. Uh, I traveled. Um, uh, the, my teacher was uh, John Alm. Uh, he's the the one I. He's the one I I. Um, your Just teacher was was John Alm. John Alm, Alm. Mm -hmm. and he taught you to play on the plant yes. flute. On the plant flute. The plant flute yes. Okay. What else did he teach you? Uh, all the. Secrets. This was back in the United States or in the United Kingdom? No, no, United States. In the United States. Are you still States. in contact with him? Yes. Yeah. Great. Uh, in the Southwest Texas University. Great. Uh, it's a uh, this instrument. It's, uh, it seems to be uh, simple, but it's not. It's a uh, lot of secrets, lot of uh, activities you, you you should do to to be able to to just to play correct in this instrument. Okay, you came back from the United States and the United Kingdom, and you decided to settle down uh, here uh, back in Egypt again. Yes. Um, how did you take this uh, decision, and why did you take this decision, and what is the reason beyond this uh, this decision? Uh, the f the first the first impression about this this instrument I I played before with George Zamfir in the in the Cairo uh, Symphony Orchestra. Mm -hmm. I like this uh, this instrument. I I attract I attracted to this instrument. So it it makes um, it makes me uh, crazy of this instrument. You, you mentioned so. Zamfir now, so right? Ah uh, yes. So yes. can we hear uh, w one of the famous Zamfir pieces from you? Sure. Please. Sure. Please.
understand that you played with the amazing renowned, um, uh, of course, uh, artist uh, in his orchestra, Omar Khairat. Uh, uh, could you tell us more about this amazing experience and what did this add to you as value? Um, uh, I played several times with Omar Khairat, but uh, uh, with the French horn, not the band flute. With the? French horn, another instrument. French horn. What's the difference between the palm flute and the French horn? It's completely different. This is a brass instrument. It's completely different. But I mean, uh, Omar Khairat means to me uh, something like dream. I dream to be like Omar Khairat. How did you feel when you were playing with him? Uh, <laughs> uh, dreaming. It's dreaming. Uh, anyway, I, I affected with, uh, with the music of Omar Khairat. It's from, from, my, um, from when I was uh, young. Uh, he was uh, the favorite uh, person for me uh, as a composer and as a personality. Okay. Uh, Mahamur, you play at the Opera House. Um, yes. uh, of course, and you present many different uh, events over there at the Opera concerts and so and so and so. Where do you play elsewhere in Egypt? El? Where did you play in Egypt other than the Opera House? Ah, I played in in in, uh, in Saqia. In? In Saqia. Saqid Sawi. Uh, Saqid Sawi. I played in the um, the opera for the for the band flute, but for the um, with the orchestra we made a, um, a round play? tour uh, all over the world with the Cairo Symphony Orchestra. Where do you feel more comfortable when you're playing? When you're at the Opera House, you feel home? Or at Saeed Sawi, or they're both the same? Uh, for me, both the same. Both the uh, same, you're yeah. indifferent. Yeah. It's when did you get into music? Um, how did it all start? I mean, uh, embracing this um, artistic career. Uh, I started um, le d learning in, in the Cairo, uh, Cairo uh, uh, Conservatory uh, from uh, when I was uh, something like 12 years old. 12? Yes. Uh, um, did you um, grab uh, international prizes um, when you were playing abroad? Yeah, I, wa I present Egypt in United States. I pre present Egypt in the uh, United Kingdom. It was uh, it was in um, uh, festivals. It was a festivals, but not. Uh, w where in the states did you, did you perform, Amr? In, uh, in which states or cities? Uh, in America? No, North, North Dakota. North Dakota. Yeah. Okay. Amra, I witnessed um, a concert uh, you were presenting at the Opera House and I saw that uh, many audience were interested in coming and watching you play uh, the pan flute and uh, uh, your, uh, actually your concert was really successful over there. Um, how do they know about you? How did they get to know you? And uh, how do they know about your uh, events when you come to uh, present um, um, a, a concert at the Opera House? You know, I'm um, by the beginning. I am. I am a son of this place. Uh, I applied to 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 present the, the. So it's like a schedule, and the people, the audience, go and um, see when Amr Samir is going to be playing, mm. and they come on the day. Yes, yes. Uh, I just applied for that, and uh, they accept that I I will play uh, the band flute uh, for the for the. It was the for the first time anyway. Uh, which audience do you feel that interacts more with you, the Egyptian audience or the audience abroad? Um, it's the same. You know, the music is an international uh, language. But there's no like Egyptians anywhere. Mm, uh, yeah, but but I mean, I mean, for the the music, everybody understands the music. Yeah, music the same is music. Way. Yeah, mm. yeah. Everybody is understands. So, so uh, how, the how same often way. do you play um, at, at at the Cairo Opera House? Uh, I mean, once a week, every day. Uh, how how often do you play perform there? Before, before was yeah. uh, every every week. Yeah. But but as a member of the Cairo Symphony, yeah. and, uh, and played the, the yeah. French horn. But now you're only a guest. Like you go there when you, you're a guest. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. Um, what are your um, plans for the coming? Um, 
period um, what do you plan on doing uh, other than singing at the or playing your uh, very special instrument at the opera house and at Said Sawi what are your dreams what do you intend to do uh, first of all I, I am trying to make a, a program which is uh, non familiar with the pen flute so a program as a program in Egypt in, in, in television or a program as a program uh, that no you're going to be working on program I, I work on oh. uh, I mean uh, the, the band flutes never plays the, the hard rock music never plays the jazz music uh, also uh, the band flutes um, used to, to, to play the romantic uh, music so I'm trying to, to improve the, the, the kind of, of the the music which is belong to the the band flute fantastic um, so you're trying to, to to add to it yeah to add an, a new dimension to the pan flute yes great that's right C can we hear another one of your uh, beautiful uh, plays sure i'm gonna play something for uh, Feiruz. Feiruz. Uh -huh. before you play um Amr, i want to ask you one question please yeah. um how many people here in egypt play the play the pan flute and are you uh, uh, thinking of making an institute to teach uh, others interested in pan flute how to play it? Yeah, why not? But I mean, um, if I if I have a chance, it's okay. But okay. Uh, how many people play it, or you're the only one that play it? Uh, it was um, uh, one uh, one uh, one player before, but um, he disappeared now. He's no more. Uh, but but so you're the only one. Uh, yeah. I you're only I'm one uh, on the scenery yes, now. That's right. So and you you're ready actually to make an institute to teach others to play it? Yeah, why not? Okay. Why let not? us uh, uh, listen to your uh, piece of. Uh, okay.
wonderful. Really enjoyed it. I mean, amazing. No, no, it's, it's, uh, yeah. Artist Ahmed Amr Samir, of you. course, uh, graduate of the Conservatoire, who lived in the United States of America and England, and who is back again um, here in Egypt. And it's a pleasure to have you here in Egypt, of course. You didn't tell me uh, the difference between the gold and the red before we wrap up today's episode of Nile Cruise. Uh, it's a um, different uh, an instrument in the skill. In there the skill, the music skill. There is many, many of them. Uh, each each one is a different scale. So that's uh, the scale. Scale. Yes, What's the musical. meaning of the scale? The musical scale. Uh -huh. Oh, you one mean the sound of the music? Um, uh, the the gold is higher is lower this is uh, what you mean no the, what the do you scale, mean the scale it means the the, the steps of the mu of the steps the of yeah. the musical notes yes right okay yes. okay Amr Samiri thank you so much for joining us in today's episode of Nile Cruise thank you Amr I really enjoy thank you for making us listen to Zamfir Dalida and Fairuz. It, it was a great joy. Thank you, thank you. And I'm sure uh, the dear Muhammad viewers Zahra enjoyed. Song that really to touch, touches me always. And Zamfir and touches yeah. me, and Dalida touches all of us. Yes. It was all beautiful, Amr. Muhammad, so beautiful. Um, this brings us to the end of today's episode thank of Nile Cruise. Thank you so much for joining. Uh, and it was my pleasure, of course, to um, uh, uh, present thank today's you. episode of Nile Cruise you, with you. Today we brought uh, to a Nile Cruise dear viewers from a very special place, which is um, the Scout Club here in Giza in Cairo a very special episode of Nile Cruise dear viewers hope you've enjoyed being with us as much as we have and until we meet again again next week Thursday 1.30 hope you've enjoyed being with us thank you so much for joining bye bye